हेलो स्टूडेंट वेरी गुड मॉर्निंग टू ऑल ऑफ यू हाउ आर यू आई होप यू ऑल आर हैप्पी हेल्दी एंड फाइन एट होम डू यू रिमेम्बर वॉट वर वी डिस्कसिंग यस्टर डे आई थिंक वी वर डिस्कसिंग अबाउट द आई आर स्पेक्ट्रोस्कोपी एंड एज वी नो दैट स्पेक्ट्रोस्कोपी इज नथिंग बट एज अ इंटरैक्शन ऑफ इलेक्ट्रो मैग्नेटिक रेडिएशन विथ मैटर इज नोन एज अ स्पेक्ट्रोस्कोपी एंड आई आर स्पेक्ट्रोस्कोपी मीन्स इट इज करस्पॉन्डिंग टू द फंक्शनल ग्रुप देर आर डिफरंट फंक्शनल ग्रुप प्रेजेंट इन द ऑर्गेनिक केमिस्ट्री एंड द आई आर ग्रुप वैलेंसी और द फ्रिक्वेंसी इन फ्रॉम दैट द ऑर्गेनिक केमिस्ट इमीजिएटली आइडेंटिफाई वॉट टाइप ऑफ द फंक्शनल ग्रुप्स आर प्रेजेंट इन द अनोन ऑर्गेनिक कंपाउंड एंड दैट्स वाय दिस स्पेक्ट्रोस्कोपी एज अ ऑर्गेनिक पॉइंट ऑफ व्यू इज अ वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टंट फॉर द स्ट्रक्चर डिटर्मिनेशन एंड येस्टरडे वी हैव सॉल्व आई थिंक वी आर सॉल्विंग एज अ प्रॉब्लम सो टूडे ऑल्सो वी आर ट्राइंग टू सॉल्व सम मोर प्रॉब्लम सो दैट द स्टूडेंट कैन गेट एक्सपर्ट they can acquire this technique how to solve the problem based on uv spectroscopy that's the main point we are discussing right now let us see i think problem number 3 so what is that problem number 3 let's see here an organic compound having molecular formula as usual and organic compound organic compound having molecular formula molecular formula molecular formula which is c4 h6 that is a c4 h6 shows ir band at shows shows ir band at shows ir band at 3300 and and 2100 per centimeter per centimeter find out the structural formula of the compound find out the structural formula structural formula find out the structural formula of the compound of the compound find out the structural formula of the compound so that yesterday or day before yesterday we already solve some of the problem or same problem the pattern of method of solving the problem is the same whatever we have applied in the previous because the pattern of that solving pattern is a remain same throughout this chapter because this chapter is known for the ir spectroscopy now if you read what is given in this example an organic compound having molecular formula c4h6 c4 h6 which is the molecular formula is given shows ir bands at 3300 and 2100 per centimeter these are the ir absorption bands are given and as we know that these ir bands are showing the particular functional group and therefore 
we can identify what kind of the functional group corresponding to these bands or signals or you can call it as a peaks so now and find out the structural formula of the compound so we are going to find out the correct structure of the organic compound molecular formula is given and as just before starting how to solve the problem at that moment we already discuss how to calculate the sites of unsaturation and there are two methods generally used for the determination of number of sites of unsaturation present in the organic compound and as i already told you that you use the most commonly method which is a very simple by using that simple method we can easily find out we can easily determine the number of site of unsaturation present in the given organic compound the organic compound the molecular formula is given and we know that first one you have to calculate sites of unsaturation number of sites of unsaturation so whether site of unsaturation always remember it is in the round figure maybe as a 0 1 2 3 4 5 etc so that type of the number of sites of unsaturation and at the beginning also when we started how to solve the problem during that time i already uh, uh, we discuss the site of unsaturation means what the organic compound may contain cycles maybe as a three member four member five member whatever it may be it is considered to be as a one site of unsaturation if two rings are there then it is counted as a two sites of unsaturation three uh three rings are there then we can count as a three but if you remember if you uh remember benzene benzene counted for four site of unsaturation how as we know that one six member ring right and there are three alternative carbon carbon double bond means three carbon carbon double bond and one four ring and in that way total number of site of unsaturation counted for benzene is a four remember so that type of the description or these are the essential thing required for that we already discuss so how to calculate site of unsaturation by applying as a first uh, let us see here the molecular formula is given let us see here c4 h6 right this is a formula now what is our first method tells us that if there is a oxygen atom or sulfur atom you can remove it or you can neglect it so but here the molecular formula does not contain oxygen or nitrogen or even though any halogen only hydrocarbons are there and therefore you keep as it is this is our molecular formula now according to general formula of general formula of alkane as we know that what is that cn h2n plus 2 which is a general formula of alkane alkane means that is a saturated compound 
Cn H2 N plus 2. Now N should be 4 here because here number of carbon atom whatever it is there you consider here. So here you can put the number of N means 4 then H 2 into 4 8 plus 2 that is a 10 right see now the molecular formula of alkane becomes c4h10 now you minus this subtract this above formula from this so minus c4h6 simple mathematical subtraction 10 minus 4 remains uh, 10 minus 6 remains as a 4 and then any numbers and that number should be divided by 2 by 2 because for unsaturation there is a 2 hydrogen atoms are less therefore 2 uh, therefore we are dividing by 2 for any number which is after the subtract uh, after the subtraction whatever numbers we are getting we are dividing with uh, we are dividing that number by 2 and whatever answer comes that is nothing but as a sites of unsaturation look at here uh, 4 divided by 2 the answer is a 2 and therefore site of uns, uh, unsaturation we got here as a 2 understood this this is the way in this is the way to calculate the site of unsaturation in this manner in every example so now there the to get the space for solving that problem we uh, I have cleaned that board now let us look at the second point what is the second point here look at here shows IR band at 3300 and 2100 per centimeter 3300 to 2100 per centimeter these are the two distinct points are recognizable IR bands are given so how to write that also you should remember the the IR bands the IR bands the IR absorption band you can write it here the IR absorption absorption bands at 3300 per centimeter indicate suggest or shows 3 3 per centimeter 30 300 per centimeter indicates indicates presence of what it indicate presence of OH NH and triple bond CH groups CH groups the bands near 3300 per centimeter always suggest the presence of there are the possibility of presence of OH NH and triple bond CH groups now third point you can mention here as compound does not contain if you observe this molecular formula carefully can you is there possibility of or are there possibility of presence of OH and NH thing apply your common sense over here here the OH and NH if you observe this molecular formula molecular formula does not contain oxygen and nitrogen and therefore no 
क्वेश्चन ऑफ दीज काइंड ऑफ द ग्रुप ओवर देयर मींस दीज रूट्स आर टोटली रूल्ड आउट एंड देयर फोर हाउ टू राइट इट हियर यू कैन राइट एज कंपाउंड एज कंपाउंड does not contain does not contain oxygen and nitrogen does not contain oxygen and nitrogen therefore and hence hence oxygen and nitrogen hence possibility of possibility possibility of possibility of oh and nh group nh group are ruled out are ruled out look at here because the organic compound which is given here it has a molecular formula is what is it c4h6 there is a no oxygen and the nitrogen and therefore possibility of oh and nh is completely ruled out now let us see the fourth point over here fourth point look at here this one the ir absorption band the ir absorption absorption band at 2100 per centimeter 21 2100 per centimeter indicate indicate presence of indicate presence of indicate presence of carbon carbon triple bond group carbon carbon triple bond group as we know that right and now by considering all above points here the fifth point you can write over here let me clean these two points so that we can write the you continue uh, the point number 5 over here so what is that by considering all of our points by considering or you there is uh, need not be number over here by considering all of our points all of our points by considering all of our point the following structure is the following following structure is assigned is assigned to the given organic compound to the given organic compound and what is it is and as we know that there are four carbon atoms are there so we can show like this ch3 then ch2 c triple bond c and the h this is the structure which we have found out by found out with the help of provided data right the provided data tell us that there are if you observe the molecular formula c4 h6 here if you count here 1 2 3 and 4 number of hydrogen atoms are 6 look uh, count here 3 4 5 and this one is a 6 now the signals at 3 3 0 per centimeter which is due to the terminal alkyne remember this one 3 3 0 per centimeter don't forget never forget to write this a signal by showing such type of the arrow now here carbon carbon triple bond 2100 as we know that triple bond reason 
only two triple bonds are there carbon car either carbon carbon triple bond or carbon nitrogen triple bond and that value is very fixed to one zero zero per centimeter and these are the two distinct peak are the these are the recognizable peak and from that we can find out the correct structure of this compound this is a in this way we can solve the problem based on that ir spectroscopy now let us see one more example here so what is that a compound shows let us see the problem number 4 here these all are the solved examples we are solving here so that you can be expert in solving such type of the such kinds of problems what type of problems we are solving we are solving the problem based on ir spectroscopy let's see the problem number fourth over here what is that a compound shows a compound compound shows compound shows lambda max lambda max to uh, lambda max at 217 nanometer lambda max this is the data provided from uv spectroscopy and before these ir spectroscopy we have learned the details uv spectroscopy starting from the basic fundamental things their principles and what kind of the information uv spectroscopy providing us in detail we have discussed all these things a compound shows a lambda max at 217 nanometer in uv in uv uv means what in uv spectroscopy ultraviolet spectroscopy that is the full form of that uv spectrum uv spectrum uv spectrum and ir band sat and and ir bands at ir bands at 1620 1620 1620 990 990 19 per centimeter per centimeter find out the correct structural formula find out the find out the correct find out the correct structural formula structural formula find out the correct structural formula of the compound of the compound in bracket they have provided molecular formula mf stand for molecular formula which is given here c4h6 c4h6 bracket complete what is our first job to read the problem carefully what are the data provided and from that how to solve that problem point to point step by step if you solve 
you will achieve the correct structure you will find out the correct structure of the organic compound let's see here while answering this type of the what we need first we require what we require first thing first thing calculate the number of sites of unsaturation that is the first point always remember site of unsaturation is o u so in a previous lecture in a previous while in a previous example we have solved this problem site of unsaturation it comes around 2 right this is a 2 we already saw saw this one so there is no need to uh, discuss that once again because here molecular formula c4 is 6 then you can uh, what we can call it as a uh, according to as a general formula of alkane cn h2n put the value of that then it uh, hydrogen atoms comes around as a 10 10 minus 6 to uh, 4 4 divided by 2 answer comes 2 so that is the way of finding as a site of unsaturation now second point over here second point what is that second point now a compound shows a lambda max at 217 nanometer in uv spectrum that is the data given over here the the uv spectrum the uv spectrum shows lambda max at 217 nanometer nanometer indicate indicate presence of presence presence of presence of presence of a dying system presence of dying system you remember this one and that is dying system means what which one ch2 double bond ch then uh, ch double bond ch2 that is the uh, as we know that it is a dying system lambda max 215 or 270 which is a characteristic of simple dyne system if that having what we can call it as a some extra bands from that we can call it so now here actually we got the answer already but let us see here what is given another ir band set third point you can write the ir bands the ir band the ir band at 1620 per centimeter the ir absorption band you can call it as a absorption absorption band at 1620 per centimeter shows shows presence of presence of carbon carbon double bond group or the stretching frequency carbon carbon double bond group stretching frequency stretching stretching frequency frequency right now let's see the point number four what is that 990 and 910 per centimeter the ir absorption bands at 990 and 910 per centimeter indicate indicate presence of presence of presence of mono substituted alkene 
मोनो सबटीटेड मोनो सबटूटेड अल्किन दैट इज यू कैन राइट हियर आर सी एच डबल बॉन्ड सी एच टू एंड नाउ बाय कंसिडरिंग ऑल अब पॉइंट बाय कंसिडरिंग ऑल अब पॉइंट द फॉलोइंग स्ट्रक्चर इज हियर लेट मी रब दिस बाय कंसिडरिंग ऑल अब पॉइंट by considering all above evidence evidence or point by considering all above points the following structure the following structure the following structure is assigned is assigned to the given organic compound to the given organic compound organic compound so what is that so the given organic compound should be this one let me show here the problem मलिकुलर देर आर दिस वन सी एच टू डबल बॉन्ड सी एच देन सी एच डबल बॉन्ड सी एच टू दैट विल बी द स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ द गिवन ऑर्गेनिक कंपाउंड लुक एट हियर कार्बन कार्बन डबल बॉन्ड सिक्सटीन ट्वेंटी पर सेंटीमीटर एंड दिज अ मोनो सब्टूटेड अल्किन Look at alkene either this side or that side. That is a monosubstituted alkene that bands are appear. So in this way, we have solved some of the problem based on this. I think remaining problem we will see in the next lecture. Till then, have a nice day. Thank you.